Hey there everybody, Jersey Rick here, Fire Officer Leadership Academy. Gonna wrap up the July videos with the Wildland Fire theme with some more safety messages and a few things to look out for. And I've talked about in one of the videos, factors that contribute to wildland fires, fuel, weather, and topography. Coming back to the weather, when it's dry and it's hot, it doesn't take much to spark off a fire. We had one in our jurisdiction here in Loveland about 2004, maybe 2005 at a construction site out in the foothills when a delivery driver showed up and he was kicking rebar off his truck and it hit a rock and it sparked and poof, off to the races. Also seen fires that have been started when somebody's out mowing and the blade hits a rock and there's a spark and the fire takes off. So some of those things to watch out for when you are there. Uh, the grills, we talked about those and one of the other ones. If you've got a grill up the side of your house and that thing catches fire, the grill catches fire, well, your house is going to catch fire also. Hey, fireworks, fireworks. They start a lot of fires. Yeah, people spend a lot of money. They'll drive up to Wyoming, buy a lot of illegal fireworks, and come back in here into Colorado and shoot those things off, and fires get started. And when those things land in the juniper uh, bushes, poof, man, they're off to the races as well. But one of the big things that starts fires, wildland fires here in Colorado, that none of us can stop, and that's lightning. Uh, lightning contributes to a number of wildland fires. But there is another thing that contributes to wildland fires, not only here in Colorado, but throughout the United States of America. And that is the people who go camping and they do not put their fire out. They walk away and they leave it burning or they stir it up a little bit and they say, good enough. And then it smolders in there, the wind comes up and it carries an ember off into the brush. And then again, you got another fire that's off to the races. If you're out there camping, be responsible. Take the time to make sure that that campfire is out. Put water in there, stir the ashes, make sure that that thing is cold. Don't walk away. Don't walk away from it. If somebody sees you walking away or they know that you were in that area when an investigation has taken place uh, and you get tracked down, there's people here in the United States of America that have paid out some hefty fines and faced jail time as well for what they have done. And it'll get even worse for you if there's a firefighter death that's involved. So make sure your campfire is out. Till next time, we'll see you later. Bye.